when it 12 year old Minneapolis boys have their sights set on becoming gumball machine moguls. Fox 9's Corin Hoggard getting us in on the ground floor here to see how this business came to be and the much bigger business that's giving them a boost. Satisfying your sweet tooth is big business for Alex Gendro and Walker Darst Rice. They're cranking out profits one quarter at a time. And it all started with their common goal. I did some research, like, of ways to make money. Gumball machines came up, and after chewing on the idea a bit, they found one, out of service and up for sale online. They cleaned it, spray painted it, and replaced some of the mechanisms in the machine. We would, like, come home from school on the same bus, and then we would just work, work on the machine until, like, 6 o'clock until I have to, like, go home for dinner or something, and then we would, like, do it the next day. They learned how to fix the machine by watching YouTube videos, but nothing online prepared them for finding a partner willing to give them space. One day, we, I think we did, like, five businesses. I don't think any of them said yes that day. All the no's could have burst their bubble, but Alex and Walker persisted. It, like, it's really hard to start doing it, but once you do it, it becomes, like, super easy, and, like, that's really all it takes. You just have to be brave enough to, like, go out. And they finally got a yes from Scott Sherman at Pizza Luce in Richfield. I just thought it was kind of a cool idea. They carried the machine into the restaurant after agreeing to pay 10% of their profits, and the business started pouring in. The boys make sure their machine stays clean. We don't want it to be like nasty or... And they take a lot of pride in it. You see these all the time, like other places. So like when you come here and you see your own, it's pretty cool. The deal they struck got even sweeter when they tried to give the restaurant its first cut of profits. You take that 10% and you start a savings account and put it in that savings account. Every time you want to give us 10%, you put it in your account and save it. They did just that, but they consider it a reinvestment account. I think it's extremely smart. Walker and Alex now want to form an LLC. They do their own accounting, and they have a business expansion plan that calls for buying a couple more gumball machines before going even bigger. We're thinking about like a, like a claw machine, a coin pusher or something, where we'd also like refurbish that. Based on their projections, the reinvestment account will have enough to buy another gumball machine in about two months. Corin Hogger, Fox 9. Aww. Those claw machines will make them some money. I'm gonna say you can't walk past a gumball machine or a claw machine without losing some money, dropping money yeah, in there. So. You know, uh, Ben Affleck and Matt Damon, they kind of started that way. Um, they put all of their acting money into one account See? and they shared it. Big so, things for these for these young men.